Steph and Will. You're married here today in the beautiful St Kilda Gardens is the public and legal joining of your commitment to one another to become husband and wife. Steph, you are the love of my life and I'm grateful for every morning that I get to wake up next to you. You are simply beautiful inside and out. You inspire me to be a better man and I'm so excited for what the future has in store for us. As your husband, I vow to love you unconditionally through times of joy and sorrow and in sickness and in health. To always treat you with respect and compassion, even after an Essendon win on Anzac Day. I promise to inspire you, challenge you and celebrate all your successes in life, except for that Anzac Day part I just mentioned. I will always be there to support you and to listen to you, even though it can take a little while for things to sink in sometimes. I vow to always be honest with you, except on those very rare occasions where your nonnas make me food I don't like and I'm trying to please them. <laughs> well, I didn't know it was possible to feel so many different emotions in one day. I've gone from nervous, to happy, to sad, to excited, back to nervous. But right now, standing up here with you, I feel nothing but lucky. Lucky that you walked into my life, bringing with you all the love, hope and silliness a girl needs. Thank you for loving me unconditionally and supporting me in all that I do. Thank you for being understanding and kind and listening to my out of tune performances in the car. You continuously inspire me to be a better person and I promise to learn from your patience and compassion. I promise to honour and respect you. I promise to support you through the challenges that life brings, including yet another of Essendon's winless finals campaign. I vow to fill your life with adventure, your heart with happiness and your stomach with protein. I vow to love you always and without reservation and do my best to accept that I'm not always right. You are my best friend and I can't imagine a life without you. So I call upon those who are present today to witness that I, Stephanie Renee Costanzo, take thee, William Andrew Fleming, to be my lawful wedded husband. Marriage will allow you a new environment to share your lives together, to join forces to face life and the world hand in hand, side by side as a team. To go on this journey, you're going to need strength, you will need courage, and you will need a healthy dose of Will's kind and patient heart, and you will also need Steph's often brutally honest but hilarious humour. You will need a lot of things, but really, you just need each other. And our wish for you is that you wake up each morning, you look into each other's eyes, and you fall in love with each other again. Fast forward four and a half years, here we are. I'm so proud to have accompanied Stephanie down the aisle. She's absolutely gorgeous. I think you'll all agree she looks simply stunning. Whereas Will, on the other hand, looks simply stunned. So ladies and gentlemen, with that being said, can I ask everyone to please raise their glasses and get ready to toast. It gives me great pleasure to pronounce you husband and wife. You may now kiss the bride, Will. <laughs> Go for it! You!
always kiss you goodbye before leaving for work. Watch Harry Potter marathons with you and appreciate your Sam Smith renditions on the long road trips. Finally, I vow to cherish our marriage with faithful devotion and to prioritise the love and happiness of our family going forward. In saying that, I call upon those here present today to witness that I, William Andrew Fleming, take thee, Stephanie Renee Costanzo, to be my lawful wedded wife.